Nicole Green has learned to wait her turn, whether that means preparing for a jump or adjusting through years of practice. The junior from Ponte Vedra, Florida has had to grind through ups and downs, but that work is finally paying off. I'm really excited um, for what the future holds and I know greater things are coming. I don't want to put a mark on anything, but I'm super, I'm super excited. The first meet of the season is considered a tune-up. So Green expected to jump about the same height she did in nationals last year, where she cleared six foot and one half inch to place fifth in the country. But her coach could sense something special in the air. I knew during her warm-ups, it was going to be a good day because I watched her do a couple things in warm-ups. I'm like, okay, we might be doing something, something special today. Hudson's hunch was correct, though she never told Green. They don't talk about the height until after she's cleared the bar. That bar was raised to six feet and two inches. Green whiffed on her first attempt, and she couldn't adjust on her second either. It was her last jump. Same routine, three steps, long strides, and she sets the top mark in the country. I would always say to myself and people who ask that like I wanted to get 6'2", I wanted the school record, I want to win nationals, but in the back of my mind it was always like it seemed so far, it seemed um, it wasn't attainable, but after hitting 6'2 and feeling better at the 6'3 jumps, that made things more like real. Green says patience wasn't always a virtue of hers, but time and effort have made her future very bright. In Chapel Hill, I'm Jonah Lossie, reporting.